Number four. Lala is the boost shouter. Yep, this is the first time that Lala being the boost shouter in a special is not, and I mean not, my biggest problem. Why is that? Because I can think of two other things in this special that bothered me more than this. I know when I was little, I wasn't the biggest fan of Lala being the boost shouter. And both this hide and seek and and some other episodes that I've seen that have that show me why I don't like it because of the audio. If you like the audio, opinion respected, but but this just isn't for me. And and all I can say is what I said earlier. Normally this would be my biggest problem in a Teletubby special, but this time I can think of other things that bothered me more than this. And here they are. Number five. What is the Lala Remembers the Snow segment doing in here? This one, I can, I can understand, kind of, for this reason. None of the Teletubbies Remembers the Snow segments, including this one, were in the UK Teletubbies Christmas special called Teletubbies and the Snow. In the US version, which is called Christmas in the Snow, all four Remember the Snow segments are in there. Poe, Dipsy, Lala, and Tinky Winky. In that order. So, what is the Lala Remembers the Snow segment doing in here? Well, that's easy. As I said earlier, none of these segments are in the UK Teletubbies Christmas special Teletubbies in the Snow, <clears throat> which, I, yeah, which I thought was a shame because the US version has everything minus the opening segment from Christmas in South Africa. But if you're going to make a Teletubbies special and not have everything from the five-part miniseries in there, then you're going to realize that some parts of it are feeling left out, and this is a mistake. When I came across this in a Chinese website, I or on a Chinese website, I didn't understand why this was in here. But then as time went on a few years later, I finally understood that none of these were in that none of these were in that special in the UK, while all of them are in the US. But, again, if you're going to have everything put in there, make sure you have everything in there. Because this, in something that doesn't fit other than snow being a weather, being a type of weather, it's just going to leave people like me confused. And finally, number six. There is almost nothing new. In this special. Let's go through all these segments one by one. First of all, Poe's Blue Sky Saw. Saw that in Blue Sky. Because that was my introduction to it. I saw it in Blue Sky and Colors Blue. Next, the Kite Flying TV event. Saw that on Seema Cater who now goes by Seema Farouk, when she uploaded the Dutch version of Teletubbies, some episodes that she had over, over 11 to 12 years ago. And we'll get to another scene in Kite Flying two more segments later. Next, the favorite things blown away from Led Yachting. Saw that in a three-part Dublado compilation that had the episodes Land Yachting, Rebecca's Dogs, and Numbers 10. 
ever since I saw those episodes in 2010 or 2011, when I think of those two episodes and the Teletubbies walking or jumping to the Magic Windmill to watch those TV events and the Magic Tree TV event in Numbers 10, my first thought is the Britney Spears song with the lyrics, I want to go all the way. Why? I don't know. First thought. Next is the Sand Castles TV event. Okay, okay, I'll give it this. This is the only TV event in this special that I saw a TV event in here before I saw it in an episode that it was from. It was until it wasn't until uh, spring of 2012 when the full episode of Saint Castles, well, the full Saint Castles, what when, when the full Saint Castles episode was uploaded in a different dub. But I still watched it there. And I first watched Happy Weather Stories in late 2011. Next is Tiki Winky Special Cloud from Kite Flying. Saw that on Seema Farouk. Next, Lala Remembers the Snow. As I just told you, saw that in, in uh, Christmas in the Snow. And this segment is in Christmas in Spain. Next, the Snowy Story TV event. Saw that in Merry Christmas Teletubbies. Next, Dipsy's Magic Weather Book. The first of two segments in here that are new to me. Never saw them. Even though before this I saw... Lala's Magic Rabbit Counting Book in Bedtime Stories and Lullabies and Poe's and Poe's Counting Book from Caterpillars on Seema Farouk. This was Dipsy's first time seeing a book or reading it and seeing what's going on in it. I didn't see the Tinky Winky's Magic Activity Book from from. Uh, from Mum's portrait until a few years later when the Teletubbies YouTube ch when the Teletubbies YouTube channel uploaded it. <clears throat> and I like this segment. It's interesting and fun. Next is the last TV event in this special, Welly Walk. A and this is my last time saying it. Saw that on Blue Sky. And the last segment in here, The Rainbow from Pavement Artist. The Dipsy's Magic Weather Book segment is from Painting Swings. The Rainbow is from Pavement Artist. And again, a new one. Uh, one that I'll give a chance. And this is actually my favorite segment in here because of the colors. Also, Dipsy has the biggest advantage over, over the others because of one scene where... He's at home all by himself, just for one shot. And then he looks through the window and sees something special. He calls the other Teletubbies, and they all see this rainbow. If you've seen an episode of Booba called Colored Bricks, the rainbow here forms the exact same uh, Roy, B Roy G. Biv order. Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, violet. No mentions of purple in there, but this is as close enough to purple or violet as you can get. This segment is also in Let's Learn English with the Teletubbies Colors. Easily my favorite episode in that. And it's actually the first episode out of six to be involved in that. I made up my Teletubbies color specials, Colored Bricks, the Booba episode, it's the only Booba episode on that DVD because, because this and, and uh, Colored Bricks follow the same Roy G. Biv order. And unlike, and unlike uh, this special in which Lala was the boo shouter, Dipsy is the boo shouter in colors. And also, Poe is the boo shouter in 
all episodes of Let's <clears throat> uh, Pause the Boot Shouter in all the episodes of Let's Learn English with the Teletubbies along with the Missing Teletubby. And Tiki Winky is the boot shouter in Pavement Artist. So, so all four are happy being the boot shouter one by one. So as for my overall thoughts on this, it, <clears throat> it has some fine enough moments with, with a new TV event and two segments that were new and I liked them. But everything else just made me wish that a rain cloud, a snow cloud, and a hail cloud would rain snow and hail all at once on this special and that would make me feel much better. So, those were six things wrong with Teletubbies Happy Weather Stories. Thank you all very much. We have just two episodes left of Season 5 to do before we close up shop for the season until further notice. Next will be, for the first time, things wrong with a trailer that it, that just felt rushed to me. And it didn't work for me since day one. And, and that's not the only trailer that is... That's not the only trailer that didn't work for me. Others from others from that show have not worked for me as well. You'll see what I'm talking about next time on William Weiss's Shaolin Fierce for the penultimate episode of the season. Until then, don't get scared.